Greetings! My name is Gordon Freeman, and I'm very peeved, and welcome back to... This. So yeah, I'm here to uh, launch this rocket for reasons, I guess. Supposedly it's going to do something to help matters somehow. Pro there's several problems with that, starting with the fact that I have no idea how to launch a rocket, but hey, going in and pushing random buttons hasn't failed me so far. Goodness. How the- How the fuck did I blow his arms off and legs off and head? And leave the to- Leave the torso and- I don't know enough about quantum physics to understand this. Whatever. Let's see. Yeah. And isn't it an odd coincidence that I've al that I've always have exactly one road ahead of me that go that always leads me forward and further down into Black Mesa, just by running around pushing random buttons, almost as if. There's something... I don't know. There's something. Like I was saying before, maybe I'm here for a reason. Like... Yeah. Hell if I know what that reason is, though. So. Maybe the universe is just jerking me around for kicks. I wouldn't put past it. Maybe I'm just anthropomorphizing the universe because of... To, uh, to, as an explanation for a bunch of things that are actually just random coincidences. Or some such. I don't know. Maybe I'm, uh, but maybe I am, as I suspect, a tool. <laughs> Let's see. Attention, all personnel. Launch control train oh. activated. Clear area immediately. Alrighty then, I'm making progress as usual. That is a beautiful work of engineering, isn't it? It is time to go, uh... Find the controls to the rocket. They're probably gonna be behind, like... And, of course, now that the alarm bells have rung, the fucking entire military is probably going to be waiting for me there. Like so. Fucking hell, what the heck was that? No, I got a few of these too. Bit of this, and bit of this, and a little more of this. Was it satisfactory? I think it was satisfactory. Uh. 
You know, at a certain point, I've stopped feeling more like a person desperately trying to survive and more like someone just, more like, you know, at a, at a certain point, it's starting to feel like, I feel less like I'm the one desperately trying to survive and more like they're the ones desperately trying to survive me. If you want, if you can get what I'm saying. Maybe I was right. Maybe, as I was saying last, last time, maybe the universe isn't out to get me. Maybe it's out to get them and I'm just a useful tool. You know. The right man in the wrong place or something like that. No, none of that. Shame on you. Eh. Really? The red light's something there. It like means that there's still that there's another one somewhere. Where the heck is this last turret? Awesome man. How the heck are the First of all, how the heck did that happen again? Uh, but second of all, how the heck are the uh, how how the hell is the military losing to these animals? I mean, I get that they might not have been like prepared for this. But I, now that I think about it, they're how long was I out? Because their response seems very... It, to send all these soldiers in on, in force seemed oddly uh, prompt. But I don't know how long I was actually out for, so I'm not certain. But yeah, uh... What was I saying? Nah, crap, I lost my train of thought. Point is... These guys suck. Not only are they... Completely failing to deal with one guy in a fucking. In, I mean, sure, I've got military equipment and all that stuff, but come on. They've got military equipment. I'm, I'm sure we were selling these, something like these HEV suits to the military at some point. Maybe not as good. But. Anyways, but at least that's. I guess you could argue that maybe they not, aren't exactly seeing me coming, that I'm just some rogue agent who happens to be the pawn of fate being in the right places to bushwhack them and all that. And they're kind of distracted by the aliens and monsters. But ha but seriously, these aliens and monsters, they suck. I've... Ow. I've killed plenty of them with just a crowbar. I mean, those guys, I mean, fucking electrobolt stuff. Yeah, that's pr that looks pretty menacing. But I mean, the thing about it, it's a, it's not actually that great because it, look how long it takes them to charge up and everything. It's relatively easy to dodge. It, in fact, it's incredibly easy to dodge, but now that I think about it, they're not very good at, at, at like leading the shots. And they're also not very bright. And they have to stop and place by the looks of it. Ow. Okay, maybe not that, it's not that easy to dodge, but come on. Point that you could still take cover. So yeah. I'd rather a good... I'd rather a submachine gun or some such at my hip than that shit. I say a lot of like sci-fi stuff that, that looks really flashy and such. Practically speaking, it's much worse than like regular conventional guns. Partly because it's so flashy. But never mind. Point is, these guys got this. There's plenty of advantages, but they're still losing. Not to mention, I mean, one of the chief advantages is that 
These guys just, these creatures just seem to be animals, as far as I can tell. Man. This, uh, these, I'm so glad we, uh, we, these, uh, these sodas are capable of, of replenishing my, uh, health, for lack of a better word. Really nice. So glad we managed to lobby the government so we could put the cocaine back in the cola. Good shit. Power 90%. Power level is 100%. But yeah, they, they're just most, since they just seem to be fucking animals. Whereas the military. I mean, yes, I, admittedly, I've made a lot of jokes about the oxymoron that is military intelligence, but they are still human. They have some baseline level of intelligence and organization. Like so! See? That was a competent ambush. For the most part. I mean, they, the follow through was rubbish. I mean. Very much a deception, exceptional, execution, abysmal for the situation. But it's still better than I expect from some alien wildlife. Then again, considering he somehow managed to not see that uh, ambush, uh, that flanking maneuver coming. <laughs> uh, but anyways, uh, but surely they can outflank and outmaneuver a bunch of random new wildlife. Then again, admittedly there is the wrinkle that is uh, these aliens fucking teleporting in and shit. Maybe a bunch of people are getting like ambushed through teleportation and telefragging and all sorts of crap like that. I don't know. Maybe they just got caught with their panties down. And, and this is just like some random bozos that happen to be nearby at the time. They're not sending their best. Well, this seems like a great place for an ambush. Is there any way that I can go that isn't this? Let me check one of those other passageways, shall I? Oh, I already got one loaded in. I have no idea how to work this. Damn it. Ow! Okay, I'm gonna stop before I get bitten to death by RPGs. That was some truly impressive shooting. Yeah, that's I'm not even certain if the bolts were going through there. I'm dying to know, where the hell is this other turret? Nowhere? I could have sworn these things turn off if they... Okay then. Not today, thank you. Alright. Maybe if I use this as cover, I can just blitz right through the ambush point. What? Where the fuck did you come from? What? Apparently certain there wasn't a person there. How the fuck did you survive? What? Huh? How did I? What? 
I I saw the inside of that gate. I phased through that. Why do we have phasing technology on our trains or trams or trolleys or whatever you want to call them? What? I don't know enough about quantum physics to understand Black Mesa. Hi. So much for evading the trap. Ha! Counter ambush. Suck at aiming. What the fuck are you aiming? The barn behind me? <sighs> uh, you can stop. You can stop the the cool music now. I think the ambush is over. Well, that was bracing. Ooh. Oh man, why do I never get to use those? Oh. Hi. Yeah, run, coward. Okay, Le elevator. Let's see if there's anywhere else to go besides that. Oh no, even worse elevator. That's, all right. Sure, why not? You know what they say, when life gives you crap, make crap golems. Oh, fuck. Yeah, place your bets now. What are the odds I can actually get through these crates without blowing them to kingdom come? Um, low. Maybe if I, hang on. I get a crate up here, I can climb over. Let's see, or... Say, now there's a thought. Ha, <laughs> 
Sometimes my genius is... It's almost frightening. Now that's a sound I like. Let's hope some of them died in that. Well, I see... No, that's just a bit of crate. I was hoping that was a body part. Let's hope this hasn't horribly damaged the elevator so it falls and I die. Nope. Alright. someone. Where the heck is it? Oh, hi! <laughs> oh, that's a beautiful sight to throw in a pineapple down and body parts come up. Now, where's the other guy? There you are. You aren't very bright, are you? <laughs> Clearly noticed a grenade. How did you not notice where it came from? Oh, whatever. And both of my grenades. Nice. Almost like the universe somehow knew how many I'd... Gotta be kidding me. Sure, this might as well be a thing that happens today. Ah! Fuck! Mm. That actually wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Well, I guess it makes sense that this suit would be insulated. Also, I think it hit me in the head where my invisible wall helmet is. Funny that I actually kind of want them to hit me in the head. I got the durability advantage. Might as well leverage it. <sighs> I think my combat effectiveness has gone up since I've stopped thinking of myself as a terrified scientist and more as a unyielding force of nature. Doesn't sound like something that would be exactly healthy for my future life once I get out of this situation, but that presupposes that I get out of this situation. So you know what? I'll indulge in a little megalomania. Okay. Teleporting. Okay. They're not expecting to run right past me. Alright. 
Oh. They all die? Shit. Let's try that again. What? Huh? Where the? What? Huh? Where did they go? I was... I was like going out of my way to protect them and then they just... Fucking vanished right before my eyes? What? Huh? What? What is with this? Nothing makes any sense here! What the fuck is happening? What? I don't understand any of this. Strange... Strange things happen for no reason. That's all I know. <sighs> well... This seems like a good time f to stop the other here while my brain fucking melts. <sighs> well, without any further ado, I have been Gordon Freeman and I'm very peeved. And remember, Dislike the video, unsubscribe if you're for some reason subscribed, and leave a nasty comment in the comment section down below. Fuck you all so much for watching, and so long, suckers. <laughs>